Hey everyone, we are checking out skyscrapers behind the production this week. Going to be sharing a little bit of insight into the message, the meaning and the story behind this video as well. So that is all coming up. Hello beautiful people, I'm Brioni Faith. Thank you for joining me another week. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. We have weekly videos, live streams, lots of music all going on over this side. So remember to hit that notification bell just to make sure you don't miss anything. So this week we are going into skyscrapers and I want to share with you a little bit of the how that video actually came to be. So of course it was another dance video project. I put out the call to dancers to submit their videos and be part of this production. What I'd love to share with you is a little bit of the kind of color grading that was going on and how to actually piece all these different pieces of video together when it has been part of a big project. So as you can imagine, you're probably getting different pieces of footage from different quality cameras, different kind of lighting from all over the world. So to piece it all together and make it look quite seamless can be a little challenging. So to give you an idea of how to actually create that and to make those clips all work together seamlessly, it's all about the color grading and getting the lighting to be consistent through all of them. Some will need more contrast than others. You know, some may need to bring out a bit of sharpness or different color tone just to make them all sort of sit next to each other comfortably and to work in a seamless flowing fashion. So with skyscrapers and often with a lot of my videos, I tend to go for the hot cold contrast. So some might be blue and that cooler tones, then we'll have other clips that will be more hot with the orange red sort of color theme coming in there. And just by creating a certain level of contrast and then working with dark vignettes around the clips and bringing in that color theming, it really does help in making these clips work together. When it comes to green screen, I have in the past used green screen from other people, but I do find that it's very, very fussy. So these days I prefer to just use a green screen on myself or other people that I get to film simply because it's very, very fussy on the lighting and it needs to be at a very high quality to get a good key. Skyscrapers was the third video in the Venomix trilogy. We first met Venomix through the Human Original Mix video. We discovered Venomix was this corporation that was all about creating cyborg weaponry and basically used people, turned them into cyborgs and they became military weapons. It was all about Agent VX fighting back out of the system and kind of reconnecting with his humanity. Then Human Industrial Mix took it to the next stage where that was about more of these cyborg weapons breaking out of the system and trying to bring Venomix down. At the end of that particular one, we had Venomix in flames, which was great. <laughs> Skyscrapers was a continuation of the story where Venomix had come back and moved into the area of creating androids as military weapons. So Skyscrapers was about the cyborgs that had broken out of Venomix banding together again to bring Venomix down once and for all. It was brilliant just the energy that the dancers brought to it but also that sort of call to action that rallying of the forces and that idea that together we are stronger I believe in the power together we are stronger we can rise above like skies together we stand so So a song with a really powerful message and I really loved bringing that out through the video, through the dances and connecting with the meaning and the message in that as well. So let me know in the comments if you think that there could be a Venomix part four. Where could the story go? If it were to go anywhere, 
because Venomex doesn't like to be completely destroyed as we've seen it came back in skyscrapers skyscrapers we did bring down the androids but where would it go next if this story were to continue i'd love to hear your ideas let me know in the comments if you think that's it it should finish there we can create a new story something else but i would love to hear from you if you think that this story needs another chapter So super inspired to share some more on skyscrapers with you guys today. Thank you so much for being here with me another week. Remember to subscribe and click that little bell and make sure you're notified of anything else coming up over here. We do have live streams every second week. So love to catch up with you on one of those. We have hangouts, performances, different things all the time. That's it. So looking forward to catching up with you big thank you to my beautiful patrons over here without you guys none of this would be possible and you mean the world to me my beautiful patron family if you're inspired to become a patron we do have a link in the description that's um extra hangouts and and lots of things going on over there as well so bye for now look forward to seeing you very very soon have an amazing week and a bientôt so with skyscrapers and with so a lot of uh, to creating military weapons in a sense of cyborg people. Mm. Uh, and that was where Agent VX was playing the character of... Is it amazing? Nah.